Dutch Sense here. 9.44 p.m. Central Time on Monday, March 17th, 2014. And we're looking at the Weather Channel here. I've got their radar and storm identification system turned on, their version of Titan Storm Tracking. And you can see a storm is detected down here over New Mexico. And it's been identified as a storm, strong cell. However, it's a clear night. And this led me to go look at another system, which is College of DuPage. And I'm going to need to play this for you to show you what the computer is identifying as a storm. And when you see it, then we'll explain it. Okay. And let me go ahead and slow this down just a little bit so you guys can see. Massive explosion of some kind. Uh, we're going to have to go look this up on Google Earth, which I've already done. This looks to be a military testing range. And whatever's happened there, massive explosion has sent a plume going across multiple counties and now going out of state. This is New Mexico again, and it's blowing east into North Texas. Looks like towards the general direction of Amarillo right now. It's being identified as a storm. So let's go on Google Earth. Let me just back this out so you guys can see that we are looking. Um, this is New Mexico here. And we'll zoom it in. And here's the county. And the large plume explosion is coming from somewhere right in this region here. We'll back this up again. And let me go ahead and zoom it in. I'm going to wait for it. Okay, so you can see the edge of the county here, and we can just come in along the edge of the county here. Now, interestingly enough, we have the Carrizozo Volcano right there, and it looks like this is a target airfield in New Mexico, Area 29. Obviously, some kind of massive explosion, whether it be a natural volcanic eruption or whether it be a human man-made explosion, we are looking at a large plume of debris being admitted. There you go. And that's right at sunset. And let's zoom in here and see if the storm ID has moved at all. Oh, they've given it a direction now. Yep, heading towards Amarillo. Uh, let's go ahead and go on to College of DuPage again and look at the next rad sites. So, um, you know, New Mexico's got a weird layout with their radar. So we'll look here. Uh, we're going to look at KMOB out of Cannon Air Force Base. Ah, the plume is blowing directly over the Air Force Base. So let's wait for it here. Well, there it is. Very interesting. Let's go ahead and look at this on... Uh, let's check a couple different feeds here. Very interesting. Let's check the velocity. And this would be the wind speed measured on the clouds themselves via the radar. Okay. And let's go ahead and look at the relative mean velocity while we're here. This will show us any radio frequency in the area. Oh, okay. All right, guys. Well, just wanted to bring that to your attention and show you that this incoming blast of whatever particulate matter that is in the air is now getting ready to travel over state lines and go into Texas. If you live in Amarillo, be aware that a large plume has erupted off of a military base and is heading your way. Cheers, folks.